Fire and use an invisibility potion. Learn a curse with Sebastian. Hmm. I am going to let the ocean. Okay, that's a little weird, but me. Hogs are made. than Hogsmeade. I can always rely on my Patronus to keep me... Ah, new face! Wonderful! Hello. Okay. Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare yew weavers available, ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Okay. You said disrupted trade routes caused you to close, Spint Witches. Terrible it's been. Trade routes reported as unusable. Evidently, criminals are overtaking roads, threatening hamlets. Yeah. I can fly safely almost anywhere, but you try flying with an inventory of brooms on your back. No easy feat. Right then, back to work. If a particular broom takes your fancy, just let me know. Do you mind sharing more about your brooms? I have a passion for them. Every detail of every model. Take wind wisps, well known for their quality ash handles. Yew weavers are rare because some fear flying them, likely to do with the Yew One's darker reputation. Then you add the Ember Dash, known for its handsome appearance. Working with okay. brooms every day makes me practically giddy. It's one of many reasons I cherish running this shop. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. What are we looking for today? Oh, I don't have enough. Nice doing business with you. Oh, I have enough for what? Let's see. That item is of the highest quality. Ooh, that one is nice. And this one does have some saddlebags and it looks like a front light. But that that item is of the highest quality. But honestly, that one looks You'll be best. thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Okay. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight. As it happens, okay. another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? That sounds well worth it. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. 
The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Okay. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Ah, I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks's enthusiasm. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Rebellion. Second. Hmm. Revelio. Rebellion. Claw. Imelda Rays? Albie Weeks sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. Yeah. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you? Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Yeah, that figures. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Ravenclaw. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. I'll probably lose the first 
first time for sure. How many after that? I'd say probably two or three. Made it. Now that's more like it! I miss the bubbles. Tell me that two minutes and something was not Imelda's record. Ugh, that's not... You, you must have cheated, you... Ugh. Fine, you won. Ugh, don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Eh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Um, I don't. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale Melton and offers like a the much average tougher Twitter challenge. Troll. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. There's always someone snoring in our dormitory. One of the girls, too. And she talks in her sleep. The other girls and I were... I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. Okay, so I need to be... Me, I'm sure. 132.08. This is rather fun. I should be able to beat 132. Yeah, I missed one. That is a tough corner. I also didn't get fully stopped like I did last time, so I might still be able to do this. This place has seen better days. Success.
Revelio. Trials. Get them. See what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Revelio. Good boulder. That's a good boulder. And also, awesome. these Charles won't get the best of me. How many more mallow sweets do I have? I probably need to get some more soon. mean gear, but okay. Rebellion. Oh, butterflies. Butterfly in the sky. I can fly twice as high. Oh, I thought I saw something up here. Revelio.
Not my fault you're a deadly great spider. Revelio. Butterflies. Also. Merlin trial when I see one. Okay. Rebellion. This is a new one. Akio. Levioso. Incendio. Compulsor. Expelliarmus. Rebellion. Uh, like a Lumos one, maybe? I think so. I think I do that. Back here. And that. Oh, there's something in the water there. Rebellion. Okay. Another one. Looks like there's three total. Lumos. Rebellion, Lumos. What's that? Set. Rebellion. Why can't I land? I don't know, it just seems stupid to me that I couldn't land there. Incendio! Ooh, an unidentified back item. Revelio. Trials over here. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. I do have to say the, the flying is very smooth in this game. Let me go, sir. Akio. Akio seems... Compulsor! Oh, no... Incendio! Akio! Incendio! There's something to this... Rebellion is yes. 
No, it comes up too quickly. So that's not the answer. Let me answer. Repair one. Good also. Expelliant. I'm not actually sure. My guess is I don't have a spell for this. Revelio. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'll come back to this one. Oh yeah, there was uh, something in the lake that I forgot about. Revelio. Oh. Incendio. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Revelio. I'd say it's unlikely this is dangerous. Like I said, probably wasn't dangerous. Revelio. I kind of there was something to that. Incendio. Akio. Levioso. Protego. Incendio. I did that horribly and I still whooped their butt. Revelio. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Hey, hey. Hello, Mr. Sammy. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Okay. So I'll leave those for now. I hope to see you again sometime. Oh, I can't equip that.
That just looks stupid to me. Whee! No. Absolutely horrible idea. Yeah. I think I just look better without one right now. I had. Revelio. Okay. I know how to flip you on your back now. Ow, I... Yeah, if I... Yeah, that's why you weren't moving. I wasn't close enough. Come on, boy! Expelliarmus! Really? You wanna do nothing? Really? Why do you refuse to fight anywhere other than in the middle of a deep lake? Shallow end. Whee. Look at my lovely broomstick. I know you want to bite it. Well, if you want to die that badly. I'll just beat you like this then. Identified back item. Revelio. Oh, there's a trial over here. Chest. Belly arms. 
that time it just flat out killed me. Normally it doesn't do that if I have some health remaining. Revelio. Really? That's kind of annoying. I know what that means. Merlin trial. I dream of making a better world for me. Revelio. Sure, this one. So what's over here? Incendio. Incendio. Revelio. Wait, what? Incendio. That one took a bit of effort. Okay, so if I remember right, I'm out now. Let's double check. Yes, I am. Okay, so I need to get some more. Revelio. Oh, it's a dude. Why don't you have a little peruse? There we are then. That'll do nicely, I'm sure. <sighs> Afraid I'm not able to let things go for what you can afford. Uh, perhaps come back when your purse is a bit fuller. Hmm? More yeah. than happy to purchase that. Good to have stock, I always say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Appreciate you stopping by. Uh, be sure to visit me again, won't you? Revelio. This way. Am I gonna be passing by? Looks like there's gonna be one right near here, so I'll mark it. Yeah, I just don't get the sense of speed that I did from Harry Potter. Could it be a Merlin trial? Merlin trial in the town. Revelio. Hello. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. I'm Fatima Lawang. Welcome to my shop. Anything I can help you with? What do you have for sale? What are we looking for today? None of this. Thank you for stopping in. Revelio. Appreciate it. Oh, 
potion recipe book. Uh, it's a book. Start it. Just grab all this stuff, tear up the area, make it easier to see. Ah, there it is. That's where I'm taking it. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. This one's open though. Okay. Expelliarmus. fly along the water. If I come across any diving spots, I can get free loot. So I'll turn in this quest, go identify those clubs, and then call it.
there's something. Revelio. Last time I did this, it was just a one room with some loot. Hopefully this isn't long. If it is, I'd just prefer to come back. Rebellio. Compulsor! Expelliarmus! Accio! Levioso! Incendio! Rebellio! Revelio. Animal and a forest sorcerer. Ha. At least it wasn't long. Yay! Come on. Oh, there's some balloons. Revelio. Revelio. Whoa! That actually scares me. Expelliarmus! Incendio! I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Revelio. See what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Revelio. Yeah, I'm just gonna go to the merchant over here. I don't really feel like doing it unless it's a puzzle I know how to complete. Pleased to see Arn has his belongings back. Ranrock and his loyalists. Hello. Him. Do you have anything for sale? That I do. But uh, what's a student like yourself doing out here? Got yourself lost, did you? Just exploring the countryside a bit. Hi. <laughs> nice to break the routine now and then. Bit of a wanderer myself, in fact. Oh, yeah. Name's Leopold Babcock. And Babcock. I am indeed here to sell. <laughs> now, 
For someone like yourself who is also prone to wander, I cannot understate the importance of keeping some Wiganweld potion on hand. I wouldn't dare set foot in a place like the Forbidden Forest without a steady supply. What do you say, my young friend? A measure of safety for the path ahead? Something to consider. Thank you for your help, Mr. Babcock. Aye, let me know if you see something you like. What do you have for sale? Let's see. See if there's something you need. Ooh. Thank you for your patronage. I shall hope to do business with you again. That's been a pleasure. Honestly, I don't like how that mask looks. Now there's a student who knows how to fly. Revelio. Oh, this one I know how to do. See, so yeah, I can do this one quick. Akio. Revelio. Here. Not so tricky after all, Merlin. Yes, yes, I get it. What a lovely little gazebo. Or, I'm not even sure if that would be considered a gazebo. Revelio. Here I come. Do, 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 do. My loot! Revelio! Oh, you're back! With something to report, I hope? Mr. Weeks, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Mm, that's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. 
Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my works had potential all along. Why would anyone doubt your ability to upgrade brooms? No, oh, you'd be surprised. People get set in their ways, worry that fiddling with what's working fine will somehow ruin it. <sighs> Those people don't appreciate the sense of freedom that comes with quality broom flight, nor do they appreciate all that's involved in the creative process. I have a friend in Rome runs a shop like mine, says it's worse there. <laughs> of course, they do nap in the afternoons from what I hear. And where would we be without enhancements? I mean, if Elliot Smethick could let the no-sayers get to him, we would never have had the cushioning charm. I don't listen to him. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Yay, hopefully more speed. Hmm. How to address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? Oh, right. Pippin's potions. This is a perfect place to stop. <laughs>